Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. The new EC patch has just come out, patch 23, and I thought I'd make a quick video because it has something very, very interesting which I've been waiting a long time for, and that is they've started to bring out customization for Space Marines, Orcs, Eldar, and Chaos Space Marines. So I thought what I'd do, I'd jump in and just show you some of the options that are out at the moment and just show off, yeah, what they basically have. Now, as you can see here already, this is my Imperial Fist, which I've already made. So if we click on this chap here, as you can see, uh, the uh, the actual Imperial Fist does uh, have actually a lot of features on him. All he's got really is a chest and a shoulder pad. Uh, the bolter itself, the Phobos pattern bolter, uh, I bought that uh, from the store a long time back, so I just thought I'd add that on because it is an awesome looking gun, and I love that stuff. So if we go back, let's start with a Ultramarine, since the Ultramarines have the most customization in the game at the moment. So to access the customization, you go to your loadouts, uh, and then you go to edit and then you go to appearance now if we start with the shoulders they've got two shoulders in at the moment so they've got the left shoulder two options so you've got a big ultramarine and you've got a small ultramarine you obviously this is the very first early stage there's a lot more to come but it's this is just the first uh, iteration of it and just getting it out and getting it to work and stuff like that so yeah uh, as we do then uh, with our RTC points uh, which you can buy from the store to make your guy look cool it's always about the rule of cool in this game for me just equip uh, but the good thing is which I'm looking forward to because I'm actually looking forward to changing this on my Imperial Fist if you go to uh, right shoulder you can actually change which company they're attached to now me being an Imperial Fist, I love 5th Company, which is the black trim, which is the standard on the Ultramarines. Uh, I was hoping that would be standard on Imperial Fist, but you can't have the best of both worlds. So yeah, the Ultramarines do have all the uh, company uh, stuff in the game, so I'm really looking forward to that coming to the Imperial Fist so I can change my guy to 5th Company. Right, if we go back to uh, the main menu, let's go all the way back, I want to show you something very, very cool. Uh, it's not Space Marines, it is the Night Lords, since the Chaos have most of the stuff, they have nearly everything in game, well not everything in game, but they have a huge majority of stuff into game. So let's go to loadouts again, let's go to edit, let's go to appearance, uh, I've done these two here, there's, there's no backpacks, there's no arms, let's go to heads. Now there are uh, quite a lot of head stuff you can get for Chaos, so let's go through them. So you've got like a little skull bat thing here. You've got this really cool, like Chaplin-esque, like back wing, uh, back kind of helmet, which I think looks absolutely incredible. Uh, you've got more bat wings. Uh, you've got more bat wings. You've got uh, horns, different color, like more like chaos. -er. You've got, yeah, Nurgle type horns. I would think you've got some like uh, corn berserker stuff, which is obviously this is. I'm actually showing this on a night lord so it's going to night night lord color but you can make a word bearer to look like this and everything like that uh you've got the word bearer stuff with the chaos star uh you've got the horns like curled up like that you've got like little small ones at the side of his head and you've got these ones here which i think is more like zinch kind of sorcerer kind of esque i'd probably put them on my sorcerer to make him stand out let's go to what's this chat let's equip it let's equip it with this and let's do shoulders because these are pretty cool as well. They've got some pretty cool shoulders. So you've got like the skull, you've got the skull with bat wings, you've got a skull with bigger bat wings. As you can see, there's some clipping issues which has got to be fixed. It's already been reported on the forms. And then you've got like these full on like chaos ones. I wish this tongue was animated. I don't know why. I thought I think it'd be really cool if the tongue was like licking out and stuff. <laughs> it'd be quite hilarious to see that on the battlefield. You've got another one here, and you've got these kind of so like these ones are like full on chaos like mutations and stuff like that let's go with the funny tongue and then if we go to the right shoulder we can get well if we want to we can have two funny tongues but we won't do that uh yeah you got the mutations this side you've got some chaos stars and stuff to go on this side the bat wings and stuff like that but i think what i'll do i'll go with a big uh chaos stuff like that so yeah so the first uh iteration of the all this all this stuff is coming in and I, I'm 
I'm, I'm, I'm so happy. I, I really am so happy because for so long, this is what I wanted in the game to just make my guy just completely stand out on the battlefield. If, because for me, that's what Warhammer is, is, you know, it's all about the rule of cool. It's about when you get the miniatures and paint them up and make them stand out actually on the tabletop. Now you can actually make your characters stand out on the battlefield. Like if you saw this guy running around on the battlefield, you'll instantly recognize him. You know, he's got to stand out from other people. Obviously, you've still got chess pieces and stuff to add on and all that kind of jazz. But yeah, you know, it's there. It's coming. We've got little over a week now till the game's released. Uh, I was speaking to the... Uh, one of the devs today and they said they are just pumping out customization stuff now they're just constantly working on it so i cannot wait f for launch to see what options we actually have on launch uh, and what we can equip to our characters so that's the video chaps uh, thanks for tuning in like i said it was only a short one i just wanted to go over some of the customization stuff we are i hope you've enjoyed it as much as i've enjoyed it uh, go into game if you've already got the game and uh, jump in and go and play around with it if you haven't got the game uh, you may be in luck because the devs have kind of gifted me five keys and I'm going to be doing a stream closer to the release date of Eternal Crusade. I'll be giving them uh, uh, keys away via the stream on YouTube and Twitch. So if you want to be around for that, make sure you subscribe to Twitch or your YouTube, whatever you, which one you want to do, so you don't miss a notification. So thanks, gents and uh, ladies. Thanks for watching the video. Uh, hope you have a nice day and yeah, see you in a bit. Thank you. Bye-bye.